We're closing in on him. Let's head down and move in for the attack. No. He's using a device that tells him our strengths as well as our location. Safe to say he probably knows we're close by. Gotcha. I'm guessing that means we just gotta meet him head on. Seven Kakarot's kid? No way! Damn this. What? Another reading? And it's... There's one? They've come. So, what brings you chumps here? Isn't it obvious? Where is he? Screaming was giving me a. But forget of you, fool! You're not even fit to call yourself a Saiyan! Prepare to die! You know, believe it or not, battles aren't just about strength. Man, he's fast. Combined power, you're still pathetic. But considering you weren't smart enough to heed my warning, don't deserve to live. You, you gotta be kidding me! You know what? Since you're going to die anyway, I might as well tell you something. The two Saiyans I mentioned earlier, they're even more powerful than me. If you've got a new attack hidden up your sleeve, now's the time to use it, Goku! <laughs> Sorry. I'm fresh out. <laughs> Lucky for you, I actually came up with a new technique while I was training. Really? A plan? Ha! It'd be easier just to lie down and wait for the sweet release of death! I'm just gonna need enough time to charge up the proper energy for it. <clears throat> gonna need you to keep him busy while I deal with this. Got it. I'll do what I can. Hope you're ready for this. Special Beam Cannon! Huh. You just don't know when to quit. 
you? Alone? What were you two trying to decide? Who gets to die first? We ain't planning on losing. Yeah! <laughs> 
just because you're my little brother. Yes! Yes, that's what I like to hear! It'll all be over soon! <laughs> Don't get comfortable! You're next! Damn, if I try to hit him now, he's just going to dodge it! Oh, 
What is this kid? You're dead! Where did you get all this power? Piccolo, now's your chance! Special Beam Cannon! Impossible! I... I can't be beaten by scum like this! I can't! <laughs> well, you just were. <laughs> I, I... I can't believe that Kakarot would just throw away his own life. You idiot. Trust me, Goku won't be dead for very long. What? Didn't you know? This planet is home to the Dragon Balls. They grant wishes. Absolutely any wish imaginable. Even bringing someone back from the dead. Uh, damn it. Well, my comrades will be happy to hear that. <laughs> Everything you just said was transmitted to them on the other side of the universe. Once they've learned that I've died, they will come here. How long until then? When, when will they... When do you think they'll get here? A year. Just one year from now. <laughs> Damn it. One year before even stronger warriors arrive. You two have no hope of beating them. Enjoy what little time you have left. <laughs> I... I see. That's pretty much it. Come on, Goku! Hang in there! It's not like you to give up so easily! <laughs> Trillin, you know... Dying... is a lot worse than I thought it would be. <laughs> uh, yeah, but... Don't you worry! We're gonna bring you back really soon! <laughs> Goku! What the? He's gone! Interesting. I bet Kami has something to do with this. Eh? Huh? Well, I guess we can put our minds at ease if Kami's involved. You guys need to get the Dragon Balls. Kami doesn't possess the power needed to bring someone back to life. Also, Goku's kid will be coming with me for the time being. What? Uh, you, you're kidding, right? What are you gonna do with him? With a little training and the right teacher, that kid could be capable of serious power. We're going to need all the power we can get before those two Saiyans show up. And me training this little runt is our best shot to stand a chance. Once Goku's revived, tell him he'll get his son back and in better shape than he left him.
Meanwhile, on a planet far, far from Earth. Raditz, the bastard went and got himself killed. He always was an embarrassment. Still, I must admit, I'm very interested in these Dragon Balls. So they're capable of granting any wish? All right, let's go. We're gonna bring Raditz back from the dead? Don't make me laugh. We have no more use for that dead weight. We could wish for eternal youth, for immortality. Can you imagine it? Nothing could possibly stand in our way. Sounds good to me. Count me in! Invigorated by the prospect of attaining immortality with the Dragon Balls, the two Saiyans made their way to Earth. And that is why I brought him here as he is, to be trained further. Therefore, if it is agreeable to you, King Yama, I humbly ask that you allow him to meet with King Kai. Hmm, I see. So you intend to take this heaven-bound soul and subject him to the grueling 625,000 mile long snake way so he can meet King Kai. Indeed. Very well. If you wish to see King Kai, then I suggest you be on your way. However, I should warn you that no one has ever, ever made it successfully, other than myself, of course, in over 100 million years. Must be one heck of a journey. I better get started. By the way, did a guy named Raditz come through here? Yes. We've got him marked down for the hell, of course. Did he put up much of a fight? <laughs> he sure did. He definitely didn't go quietly, but I sorted him out. Whoa! You must be one heck of a strong guy! So, you were sent along with him, huh? I am the great King Yemma. I occupy a position above that of the Earth's Guardian. Do you know what that means? That means you're crazy strong, right? You don't seem to understand what I'm saying. Of course I'm strong! But it's not just my strength that serves me in this position. You need brains to do this kind of managerial work. Mana, mana what work? Now then, to help you better understand my work, let's give you a little quiz. Uh, well, um, actually, kind of in a hurry. Well then, if that's going to be your attitude, then I guess you don't need to see King Kai. Oh, what? No way! Okay, okay, I'll take the quiz. Why didn't you say that from the beginning? Anyway, let's begin. I'll let you through if you can answer all of my questions correctly. That's right. He made a mess of enough planets to earn himself a place in hell. In fact, he's one of the biggest pains we've ever had to deal with. Right, next question. Correct, of course I am. I am much more powerful. Isn't that right, Kami? Ah, yes, King Yama. You are more powerful. Right. Next question. That's right. No matter where they're from, 
All who die come here. Like your brother, he wasn't an earthling. Next question. Not bad. That's correct. Those pesky Dragon Balls are indeed how you do it. I hate those things. It's like my job doesn't even matter. Who created those blasted balls anyway? Care to shed some light on that, Kami? Oh, uh, Ginyama, I... Uh... Whatever. Moving on. Sorry, but that's incorrect. Huh? What? This is the fifth question, right? Really? Um, one, two, three. Hmm. Of course it was. I, I was just testing you. And you passed the test. Well, that was the true fifth question. There's that trademark denial of his. Hmm. I heard that, Kami. Maybe I'll send you to hell when it's your time. Oh, please forgive me, your highness. Boy, he's got one hell of a sense of hearing. <laughs> <laughs> you think you're some sort of funny man. Hmm. That's enough of all this. I will allow you to see King Kong. Wow, really? Thanks a bunch, Mr. Yemma. Don't tell me you've forgotten who you're talking to. No, 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 Mr. I'm King Yemma. I haven't. <laughs> That's more like it. If you're going to see King Kai, then go. Well, this is where we part ways. Good luck, Goku. Thanks. I'm not really sure what to expect, but I'm pumped to meet this King Kai guy. <laughs>